You are a good kisser, like oh my goodness. Yeah, I had these beautiful lips since I was 15. Oh my, that's a long time. Did you know at 15 I lost my virginity? Really? Yeah. If you and I met by the time I was a teenager to around my 20s I looked like the most beautiful thing who's ever stepped in front of anyone. Am I interrupted? No no Huey, you made it to the living room at the perfect time. Why is that? Well Huey, you know Ida and I have both been together for the past three months. We never splitted up. We never argued. We never thought about breaking up and never seeing each other again. So where is this getting at, Granddad? Your grandfather and I are gonna do one of the most romantic things we've never done. What's that? Ida and getting married. Wow! I'm happy for you guys. You guys are gonna be great together. Thank you. I'm gonna be you guys' second grandmother. The hell is going on in here? I'll tell you what the hell is going on. Granddad and Ida are getting married. Granddad. You're getting married to this old broad? Yes. Excuse me? You're excused. You're marrying my granddad. That means you two are gonna be husband and wife. Yes. And you're gonna be our... Grandmama? That's right. Huey, if I die tomorrow, let Mama and Papa know. I love them with all my heart. Cause it's getting attacked. Riley. Pull yourself together, Granddad and Ida are getting married, get used to it. Now can your great-grandmother get a hug, baby grandson? I hugged her already, it's your turn. should be the name of my album. Da Fundraise and Crip. Na Tu Ghetto. Na How About A. Da Public Menace Crip. Now that's even worse. There it is. Riley? What the hell is yo problem? What you mean I'm just thinking of what should I name my next album? And I think I found out. Yeah what's that? It's called I Don't Want I To Be My Next Grandmother. Riley? Ida and Granddad are gonna get married pretty soon, okay? There's nothing much we can do but be happy for them. I mean you don't remember when every time Granddad be gone to work or anywhere else? He would always have her babysit us like we five-year-old kids, and he got the nerve to plan a marriage with her. Yeah, she did always get that us like we was her kids. Exactly. But Riley she does it because she loves us. I swear you sound stupid. I sound stupid, Negro you the one hating. Look, I'm gonna go downstairs and congratulate them for you. Yes! You go to that for me. And while you down there, you let Ida know if I die, I love her with all my heart? Okay, Riley, whatever. Okay. Look, Ida, what Riley meant to do was say congratulations, and he's proud and happy for you and Granddad. Yeah, I know. You thought he was being rude. I mean, Riley is always acting weird. Hey, has Riley always been like that? Nah, not that much. I mean Riley can be serious about certain things you know. People joking around about a girl he dated in. People talking about his rap albums in a rude way. Don't want you to date Granddad. <laughs> Huey. You know you might be smart but you funny. Sometimes you remind me of my 25 year old grandson. You got a goofy grandson? No he ain't goofy he just liked to be funny. Okay. And do you know something? I noticed all four of us have never gone out and did nothing together. You want all of us to do something together? 
Yeah, you know go out for a bite anything like that. Now we can dance. You can dance? Yeah. Uh. Uh. Boy, you can dance. Watch me. Oh, oh. Okay, I'm out of breath. Okay, let's cool off. Boy, you can dance. Yes, I could. So can you. Yes, thank you. For sure. I did my brother and you? No, why you ask that? I get it. I'm in you, your brother and your granddaddy's way. Ida, no, that's not what's going on. You see, you're just a regular and smart lady and granddad is more like a ladies' man type of person and me and Riley are just a couple of dorks. You guys are not dorks. Why would you say that about yourself? Ida, we're mature and childish. And TBH, we never had sympathy for most of our granddad's dates. Really? You probably still remember that night when Riley and I were pretending to act like good people. The night we hit bars trying to be like Ron DMC. <laughs> Huey. You two are the most active kids I ever met. That's it, go on upstairs and get dressed for dinner. Riley, get dressed, we're going now too. What the hell? Wait! Huey, it's not what it looks like. Well, you better start explaining, because I am about to pull my phone out and start taking pictures. I'm just dumb. Trina Beatrani? Come on, Huey, it's kinda embarrassing. I'm pulling my phone out. No! Going to Instagram? Stop! Instagram story? Huey, I'm not playing. And I'm bought a post. I told you to stop. See what happens when you try to embarrass me? I swear to God if my phone's cracked. What you gon' continue to embarrass me? I'ma pick it up and you gon' see what's up. Yeah, you lucky. Now back to this. But you gon' need more audiences. Granddad. Ida. Come take a look at Riley's outfit for dinner. Shut up, Huey. Look, Jesus. There's something I am doing on one of my rap videos. Trina dress like Nicki Minaj? No! I'm supposed to play a female thug rapper. Riley? You couldn't find anyone else to do that? No. Look I'll help you with that alright? You don't need to be looking like Nicki Minaj. Next thing you know your viewers and fans are gonna start calling you chick -reasy. Okay I think that was funny. Yay, now get dressed maybe we'll find someone while we're at dinner. Alright, hey good looking out helping me with this. I'm your big bro. I have to help you. We're almost finished. I'm gonna be downstairs. Okay. I don't have to be a woman. I don't have to be a woman. So I thought about where should we get married? We should go to Africa. Africa. We can't try like Europe or Russia. Rome. Why would we go to any of those countries? Why would we go to Africa? I mean, because it's nice out there, it's better than Canada. Yeah, we shouldn't get married around those Canadians. Look Huey, we have to hurry up and find someone to take the female thug rapper spot. Riley chill, you acting like we gotta go to a studio tonight, we'll find someone. Now what if we sit here all night? Now why would we? There's a lot of cute and thugged out girls that comes to this restaurant. Yeah in your words. Riley keep on with the Russian. You don't be sitting there looking like the Statue of Liberty. What? They oughta name you the Statue of Riley Freeman. Bingo! Found someone? Huey? I'll be right back. What are you doing? Hold up I'm gonna be right back. What up? This yo boy Young Reezy standing in front of you. Now as you see there's a special spot for you in my rap video I'm making in a few days, and I was hoping that you'd join me. What's the spot? I need a thugged out female rapper. And you're that perfect person. How much is this... spot? Um. 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 Hold that thought. Huey. What? She wants to know how much is the spot. How much is the spot? Yay. 
How much paper you got with you? I only have twenty dollars. I'll take that. Riley, what are you doing? I'm trying to make this payment good. I don't want to give her just a dollar. So you snatching my money is gonna make the payment good. Yes, Huey. Yes, it will. With me having 80 in my pocket and you passing me the 20, it's gonna make 100. Now sue me if it goes bad. I'm gonna be right back. My bad if I took too long. Anyway, the payment is $100 if you take the spot. I have to pay $100 to take a spot. No! You earn the $100. Look. Young Reezy, it's gonna have to take more than a hundred bucks to let me join your little rap game. I'm sorry sis that's the best I can do. Well I'm gonna have to walk off on this. Aw oh, come on I need someone. I don't wanna dress like a female. You look like one. Oh yeah. Well you look like... Queen Latifah. Damn! Riley. Get back to your seat. I was washing my hands. I just got from using the restroom. Man, Huey, I blew it. Yep, looks like you gone have to dress like a female again. Ha 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 You know what, Huey? You was never no help. I'm going home. You know we can do this around the fall. We don't have to do this now. Yeah, we're just planning it, you know? Yeah. I I love you. Robert. I love you too. Like seriously I can't believe we met each other. I agree with you. Granddad. I'm gonna go find Riley. Yeah yeah go look for your brother. So where were we? We were talking about how we met each other. to it. First, what I do to what? And second, aren't you mad at me? Yes! And in 10 seconds I'm gonna be mad at you double doggy style. Now where are my lady pants? I put them in the washer upstairs, and they probably shrunk. You know what? You are the most vilest brother I've ever gotten. Yeah, I am the worst. What's next? Huey. You better tell me what you said was fake, or I swear to god you're gonna see a whole other side of me you've never seen in your life. It's not fake. Huey. Riley, all you had to do was give the girl a better deal than you would've been straight. If she wasn't gone take it, you could've found someone else to do it. I knew what I had to do. Well why didn't you do it? I didn't bring enough cash with me. Another thing, why do you need the stupid lady pants? Well obviously I couldn't find a girl to take the spot, so I might have to do it a weird way. Riley no you don't. Yes I do because you didn't even try to help me with the offer. And you got rid of my lady pants. Look I'm tired of talking about this with you. Why did you destroy them? I didn't like them. Gave me a better answer. They were ugly. I ain't buying these stupid ass answers Huey. Look Riley, you wanna know why I got rid of the pants? It's because I am not finna have no lil brother who dresses like a girl rapper, because they can't find a girl who raps. You look gay wearing girl pants Riley, I don't wanna have a bro who does that. Listen to the principle I am trying to tell you. Is that what you think Huey? I look gay in them pants? Yes! You look gay in those. I guess I didn't really need the pants. In fact, I don't need a girl rapper. Huey? You and I can just make the track. Now hold up bra. Now for real, let's do this. Are you sure about this? Yay. Okay if this what you want, I'm in. Alright. Let's not act so immature. My bad. Hey but for real, good looking out for this big bro. No problem lil bro, that's what we bros for. Now Trey Smith would allow Jaden to wear lady pants, but Huey Freeman wouldn't allow Riley. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Man, Huey, we wrapped our asses off. We ought to call ourselves the rappers of brotherhood. What's up, something bad? Nah, I'm just looking at the comments. What they say, I mean, are they good? Yeah, they good to me. Cause they ain't really talking about the song they talking about, yo, lady eyes. What? Look for yourself. I'll be back.
I'll be at the studio. <laughs> Rock to the rhythm, you don't stop.